Hey guys, Mechanic CG here and welcome back to WRC. If you guys are enjoying the content, then feel free to leave a like, comment and subscribe. And also check out the description. I've got a link tree link there. You can follow me on all my socials. This video is streamed live on Twitch and YouTube. If you want to help support the channel, make sure to drop a subscription and a follow on their respective platforms and enjoy the video. If you want to get cheap game keys for Xbox, PlayStation or PC, then check out Eniba in the description down below. Hey guys, Mechanic CG here. Welcome back to a new series. Today, we're playing WRC. Um, I'm very much a huge fan of WRC. I've loved watching Actual Rally on the WRC channel. Um, I've played a significant amount of WRC 9, 10, and Generations. Uh, I'm very much looking forward to this series. Obviously, it starts off with WRC. And goes all the way up to 10 and then generations i know they're technically two different development studios that worked on this series but this is sort of like the second life of the wrc game there was obviously the ps2 era there's this era and then there's a new era which is codemasters which is questionable but uh yeah i'm very much excited to do this um i will admit we've already done the first event but we'll do it again uh, because I messed up the recording slightly. But other than that, this one's basically just a taster of rallying. Ready? And we're on. Kind of forgot I changed the uh, transmission. Uh, transmission is going to be manual transmission in this as well. So we're going to be fully manual transmission. Right, very long, I think we got a slightly better time that time. go proceed let's move on to the next one then shall we so for this episode all we're doing is doing the academy events so second one is all about tarmac rallies daisy welcome to the stream how are you today hopefully you're having a good day Good start so far. So these cars are going to look a little bit twitchy for this. This game doesn't actually support um, controller. So what I've had to do is use Steam input and put actual uh, keyboard keys as some of the buttons. It works well. But accelerate and brake is basically just on off switches. Same with uh, steering, it's just left or right. There's no sort of in between. Fair enough. That is challenge pass for that one. Done a good job with Seb Ogier there. Alright, move on to challenge three. I believe this is snow now. Let's give this a quick try. Oh! And we're up. I'm going to be... Oh, no, no, no! Are you okay? That has not gone very well. Let's try that again. <laughs> I'll be honest, I am a huge fan. Loki, what up? How are you today? I'll be honest, I am a huge fan of snow. Has a little sense of uh, unpredictability right to this. So. Right three. Left 
Are you in the low key? Fair enough, fair enough. Go, that's all gone. All done. I love the fact that Samsung uh, sponsors in this. It's quite cool. We had a long time no see, man. Uh, right, we got. I believe we've got three more for this one, and then it's the Advanced Academy, which is going to be the difficult one. All right, we got the Subaru Impreza for this one. Now, go, no press, go. no beat star. Yep, no beat star today. Starting a brand new series. And I'm streaming Left on right. YouTube hands. Streaming on both again. 80, right through. Whoa! Left three in, right four, cut. 80, pep in left, trees inside. Pin right, barrier inside. Woo! That's not bad. And Mads Ostberg. I think that's how you say that. And if it's not, slightly embarrassing. Only six minutes into the episode as well. It's quite a short. There for a first time this year. <laughs> it has been a while since I've streamed on YouTube. So. Holy fuck! No! Right six into left six. Hairpin right. So, uh, the one thing I'm not so good at is, uh, tarmac races. So anything to do with, like, snow, dirt, I'm actually quite good at. Hairpin right. I don't know, it, it seems like the unpredictability of dirt and snow is more predictable than tarmac. Like, you turn a corner and you expect it, the car to turn, and then when it doesn't... Ah, oh, you've actually got to beat them. But yeah, when you don't... When you lose control of the car on asphalt, it just seems like that's it. Whereas the unpredictability of, like, dirt races can sort of be countered, in a way. 100, slow down, right 6 into pep in right. 60, left 3, and left 4. Pep in right. I am also on medium difficulty, but if I find that it's a little too easy, I will turn it up. Left six, 60, pep in left. That just screams skill issue. Look, it's Kimi Raikkonen! Oh, I miss Kimi in uh, Formula One. Alright, it's time for the final one. Uh, so this is Portugal. Tarmac and gravel. So this is where it starts to get difficult. Having to swap between um, two. Probably still is. It's Kimi Raikkonen. Ready? Go! Right, three, no. Yeah, no, I saw that. Left six. Kimi was back in the paddock. Right, four, in, left six. Oh, shit. Right four. Left three. Drop outside. Okay. My co-driver didn't tell me about the drop. I didn't listen to it, apparently. 
Alright, and we're off. Right through, no. Left six. Right four, in, left six. So yeah, now that I'm right actually, four. like, going to be doing two series three, at the same time. Oh, I always did it twice in a row. Right two, cut on tarmac. Yeah, now that I'm doing two series at the same time, I think I'm going to have a much more enjoyable time playing Forza again. So I think the plan is uh, three Forza videos a week, four WRC videos a week, um, for now it's just going to be WRC videos until I get Forza back on track. I mean, I do have Forza videos that are ready to go up, so... I could start right posting those in, again. Left three. Right two in, left four on dirt. See, the one thing that distracts me a bit is this driving left line. Three in, right three. Why is there a driving right line three. when I don't need it? Left four in, right three. I assume it's for the academy, but I would like to get rid of it now. Streams. Yeah, 100%. I do a little bit as well. I wouldn't mind uh, cracking on with those again. WRC FIA World Rally Championship. Well, that is the basic academy done. But we can now move on to the advanced stuff. So, tackle hairpins. This is basically what we got to do now. Is this Ken Block's car? Now, go, go. I have a feeling Ken Block might be in a couple of these games as well. I don't know whether this was the same time period that he was doing. Whoop! Right two, into right two. Left six. Right four. Over bridge. Oh, shit. Left foot, rocks outside. Ah! Right four, in, left four, low. It is Ken Block's car, I thought it was. <laughs> that was one hell of an end to that one. All right, challenge number two, or technically challenge eight. Uh, I wasn't actually paying attention to what this is going to be, so we're going in blind. Yeah, rest in peace, Ken Block. Ken Block was one hell of a driver. Left three, no building outside. Right three. Right three. Left two. Right three in left two. Left chicane, bump cut. Right two in left three. Woo! Honestly, nothing... Ah, oh, it's Danny Sordo. I think he's in all of them, I believe. He's been a rally driver for a long time now. Uh, yeah, no, Ken, Bl Ken Block had some balls of steel. You could read your fucking YouTube chat. What's wrong with me YouTube chat? Oh, it's because you're swearing in it. YouTube blocks it. That'll be why. Jump. 
jump very long. White six in left four. Right three, very long, Titans. Right two, in, left four. That's so close to the ghost. No! How many seconds? Ah! 0.18. Let's try this again. Ready? Go! Right four, Titans. Jump! 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 Very long. Right six in left four. Right three, very long. Titans. Right two in left four. There we go. Across the finish line. That's a good one. Right. Challenge 10 is Citroen C4 for this one. It's been a while since I've seen the Shell logo in motorsport. Are they still a sponsor for Ferrari? Right six. Happy right and break. Happy left and break. Barrier outside. There we go. I like how it's got auto glass, but the I assume the Spanish version of auto glass on that. Auto glass repair, auto glass replace. All right, we got to jump from the start for this one. Ready? Go. Jump. Water. Jump. Right two. Through gate. Don't cut. Bump. Left three. No! Eyes on the road. Oopsie. That's uh not what we were looking for. Go! Jump. Through water. Jump. Right two. Through gate. Don't cut. Bump. Left three. Right three. Bump. Left three. Oh! No. Okay. <laughs> this one's a little uh, trickier than the other ones. I think we should be able to get it this attempt alone. Ready? Go! Jump through water. Jump right okay. through, through gate. Don't cut. Bump left three. Right Slow down a little more than I'd like. Bump left three. Right four. Left four. Right three. Through gate. Right through, no. Not bad start so far. Ooh. Left three, no. And there we go. I love how muddy the car gets as soon as it just leaves. It's like caked in mud. Right, we're on to the final license test. It's in the Jordan Rally this time. 
By the way, if you're watching on Twitch and you want to see the stream at a higher frame rate and a higher bit rate, higher quality, head over to YouTube. There's uh, less adverts there, much higher quality. Whoop. It seems to be like a full stage as opposed to like a partial one. No hands, you should stay on YouTube. It is better. No! I had enough time saved up, that was fine. When you said less ads, I got ad on YouTube. <laughs> To be fair, that's also a cool part of streaming on two platforms. As soon as there's an ad on YouTube, just watch it on Twitch and then come back afterwards. It's brilliant. But yeah, that is all of the tests done. And that is technically the first episode of WRC. So thank you all so much for watching. Hopefully you have enjoyed. We'll see you in the following episodes. Peace out.